Hey everyone, it's me, Ipin iPhone, and this is my review of the leather folio for the iPad mini from Odoyo, which retails for $49. This is a folio style case made of leather. The stitching on this case is really impressive. There's no flash or anything that will make it look like it was cheaply made. The unique feature of this case is the removable hand strap, which makes the iPad mini very easy to carry around. If you don't want to use the hand strap, you can simply unclip it. On the bottom right side of the front cover is a nice Odoyo branding. The surface feels really smooth and the front cover is padded to protect the iPad mini. On the side, we have this magnetic flap that securely keeps the case closed. At the back, there's this tab here that holds the front cover when in stand mode. It also has that same Odoyo branding. There's also a cutout for the iPad mini's camera. There are slots inside the front cover to store a couple of credit or business cards. The inside of the case is lined with soft microfiber that will really protect the iPad mini while it's inside the case. Here's the U-shaped cutout for the home button and the cutout for the FaceTime camera. Here's a flap that will hold the iPad mini in place. To install the case, just slide in the iPad mini and then tuck in the flap on the side to secure the iPad mini. The home button is very accessible, while the volume buttons and the silent switch are kind of hard to reach because of the design. You really need to stick your finger here to access the buttons and switch. Same goes to the sleep-wake button. However, there are sufficient cutouts for the mic and the headset port. At the bottom, the speakers and the lighting port are fully exposed and really easy to get to. And at the back, the camera cutout is spot on. The case adds a little bit of bulk to the iPad mini but that is to be expected with this type of cases. The case also features the auto on and off function every time you open and close the cover. The case also folds into a stand by tucking the front cover in the tab located at the back of the case. You can only get two angles with this case, one for comfortable movie viewing and one for typing on the iPad mini's on-screen keyboard. The only minor thing that I didn't like about this case is that sometimes you need to readjust the iPad mini inside the case because it slides out of place. I think if there's a velcro or magnet on the side strap, it will really keep the iPad mini securely in place. But other than that, this is a really neat looking case. It's heavily padded so it protects the iPad mini very well. It looks very professional and the optional hand strap is an added bonus to a really functional case for the iPad mini. So, if you are interested with this case or want to know more about Odoyo, just head over to their website at odoyo.com. They also have some awesome cases and accessories for the iPhones, iPads, and the Samsung Galaxy S3. That's it for my review of the leather folio case for the iPad mini from Odoyo. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like my content, leave a comment if you have any questions, and please like the video because that will really help me a lot. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.